Set moves play a huge part in a team's preparation to perform on game day. And in this video, I'm going to dive into the details of one of my favourite strike moves, the scrum tee. Old Glory have a scrum 5 metres out from the try line, with around 25 metres of space on the left hand side. New York are defending with two backs on the blind side, along with scrum half Connor Buckley who's defending tight to the scrum. The play of choice for Old Glory is what I call the scrum tee, as number 10, Joaquin Diaz Bonilla, is stood directly behind the scrum. Both centres, Martinez and Palamo, and wing Lasanka are stood to the left, leaving fullback Kurt Baker and right wing Marcos Young on the right side. The key to success with this play is in getting the second defender to bite in, to create space on the outside. So, scrum half Tusitala has to run across the field to fix the inside defenders. But importantly, he has to stay as square as possible to make the defence think that he's going to run himself. Fly half Diaz Bonilla has to remain really patient while sliding left so that he can receive the pass behind the lead line runner. Finally, outside centre Palamo aims his lead line at the inside shoulder of the second defender, which causes them to move inwards, and by the time they react to the pass out the back it's too late meaning that Diaz Bonilla can straighten and take the gap, with New York fullback Andrew Coe unable to close the gap in time. I'd love to hear your thoughts, so why not leave me a comment down below, and don't forget to hit the like button.